Hello, Dennis here, and this is vlog number five. Okay, so what I'm gonna tell you in this vlog, um, yeah, actually two things. I'm gonna show you uh, how Verbund Oki looks like. There's the biggest, um, yeah, seller of, yeah, hockey equipment, only goalies. And yeah, I think the world. I don't know any other store that only sells goalie gear, just goalie gear. Um, so I'm gonna show you what they do over there. And um, of course, I have the review of the new Obo Robo Plus kickers. I know I tried them out for a couple of weeks, and uh, I will tell you something more about it. Have fun. Hello. A lot of people were waiting for it. Um, I'm gonna do the review about the new Obo Robo Plus kickers. Um, have them now for a couple of weeks and I want to thank Verbund and Obo for uh, trying them out. Um, and I've got already a lot of questions uh, on how they are uh, on the pitch and how they look like, how the inside and the bottom looks like. I'm gonna show you everything uh, today. Um, I also let them uh, try a couple of other goalies, so it's not only my opinion, it's an opinion of a uh, lot more goalies. Um, but this, these are the kickers. Um, this is uh, a size L, so the large. Uh, they will come out in the summer. And also, of course, in the other sizes, but this is just uh, the large, so you can uh, see how it looks. Um, and to compare it, I also got my old ones, uh, also a large, but in a different color. And then we start with the biggest difference, and uh, they are squared, yes, which you can see. But the big difference is the inside on this side. If you can see, there's a good difference. The top over here is a lot higher. Uh, so the inside of the feet, because there's really a right and a left side, uh, the inside of the feet still here. <laughs> okay, this happens when you try to shoot a clip uh, on a nice occasion. Uh, you couldn't see it. it right away but I'm actually on uh, about 15 meters high because um, I'm in the nicest stadium in Holland I'm here in uh, the Wagner Stadium uh, I'm sitting all the top uh, at the yeah the seats where the, the media is normally um, but it's a little bit windy so uh, that's why my camera fall, fell down uh, but I'm still here. <laughs> Luckily, my phone is not broken. Um, okay, let's continue. Um, the biggest difference is the inside. Uh, it is flat, as you see from the in front. It is flat, straight up. So balls that go in over here can't go up anymore. Um, and of course, it's a bit curved over here. It's uh, another yeah surface that's straight. Uh, so the balls stay this side, it's not really bent like the old one and uh, like this side. Um, and the surface over here is 20% bigger than the one over here. So uh, because of this is higher uh, and it's all flat, but also because it's lower to the ground. Uh, and that has something to do with the bottom. Because um, this is designed, and you can see it a bit, um, from here a shoe will go in straight. Let's get a shoe, I will show you. We have shoe and it's going in like this. At first it is hard to fit in, but you can see my shoe right now. Yeah? That's um, not a problem, uh, but it's a bigger advantage of this one, uh, that the shoe is made inside the kicker and here it, the, yeah, they try to fit in a shoe. Here they made a sh it take, it took a shoe and designed the kicker around it. Um, here you can see the toe, and that's why some goalies 
have bruises on their toes because uh, you can hit on your you can be hit on your toe and if you do it like this you can barely see it and really it is in you can barely see it and that's because and it's almost all the way in the top the finger can't really fit in it um, that's because the inside here is deep so they made it straight up so you, your toes really have some space um, so that's a big big improvement no longer hits on your toes anymore um, the other thing is that this is really thicker than this it's also a big different foam um, and therefore a big big rebound uh, as you could see in the pic in the clips uh, that we uploaded this uh, this week and last week uh, I already wore them um, they have a really really big rebound without doing anything it's like she cheating uh, you get a ball on it phew, very easy um, and because of this that this is thinner the entire kicker is also lighter than the kicker here it is 10% um, lighter, I think. 10, 15%. It's a lot. And when you have it in your hands, you can really feel the difference. Um, okay. Um, those are big differences. Bigger surface area. Um, like here. Better space for your toes. Here it's much more improved, so your toes can't um, really be touched anymore. Um, and it's also, and I didn't think about it right away, but um, in Holland um, and in Europe, we also play a lot of indoors and it's getting bigger and bigger. When you use these kickers indoors, uh, balls stay lower, much easier, of course. Uh, and that's a big, big difference. Because uh, uh, every ball that's going high from your kicker can be uh, a penalty corner against, and you don't want that, of course, in, a, in, a, in an indoor match. Uh, with this one, um, it's so much easier to keep the balls low because of that it's really flat okay um, okay and the last things um, the rest of the kicker stayed the same as the old ones so this flap, I don't know, flap um, is exactly the same size as the old ones so the leggards will uh, go on top every legged of oboe will go on top very easily without problem um, the straps over here are exactly the same they're uh, placed on the top a bit different than the old ones but they are exactly the same because you can, so you can put them in and the one in the back exactly the same so they made that very easy so you don't have to buy like an apple you buy a new phone okay new uh, new thing new this new airplugs new this uh, it's all the same so the old ones don't apply and you can use them as well um, okay what do I think about it um, I think they're awesome uh, like I said it is like cheating the balls go uh, away so easy and stay low so easy um, you don't really need to uh, put a lot of pressure in the ball, so not a lot of pace. Um, so you can more focus on uh, where you want to place the ball to, so instead of pushing very hard through the ball. Um, was also a big advantage if you have a standing block and you have your both kickers next to each other like this. Um, and someone is shooting from close range, uh, what you now had is with the ball got on your toes, it went up and very easy a penalty corner against. Uh, now the balls stay low. Um, also, balls, when um, you're, you're trying to stop a ball in the far corner and you really need to stretch, okay, it can't hit your toe anymore, but also when it does hit this part of the glove, it doesn't go up and maybe end up in your own top corner. It will stay low. Um, so it's a big advantage uh, for not having anything, um, yeah, unneeded penalty corners against. So uh, those are what I thought and I uh, used them in a shooting session of Hockey Heroes TV last time. I tried them out for just kicking uh, in some uh, coaching. I kicked with the, the under 11, 12 
goalies. I tried them out and kicked uh, back and forth with them, um, but I also used them. <laughs> they asked me to train together with uh, Laia and uh, Charlotte in their training session, um, and, and I also used them. Um, and it's really easy. It is feels so comfortable, um, feels safe, much because of it's much thicker. Um, the only thing I really have to use, uh, get used to, is because this is more close to the ground. When you walk, it feels different. It's not uncomfortable, but it feels different. When your foot goes over here, normally that's much bigger surface to the ground. Now you already feel that there's something on the ground. That's the only thing you need to uh, adjust in. The rest, great things. Awesome. Um, these are now in red, and as you can see, uh, the, the goalies that use them, um, Seb van der Ven, Hede Brink, uh, Loïc van Doren, um, and a couple of more in Holland, Alexandra Herbaert, um, uh, Maurits Visser from Den Bosch. Um, they use it and they now all have it in red. That's because it is still not in stores, so they only made it in red, but they are coming towards Holland right now, also in black and in orange. And when that's done, they will do more colors, I think. Um, yeah, that's it. I would say, try them out. And look in the clips, what you can do with it. And next summer, they will be in the stores, so you can also uh, use them. Hello, it's the 3rd of April, and as you can see, Obo, um, I'm here uh, in Dongen, and Dongen is a place in uh, the south of Holland, and uh, what they do here is they have a real goalie shop. It's not a small one, they have everything, from goalie gear to train with, to laggards, all the parts from Obo, even some other stuff. Uh, and I'm gonna show you around over here. Hello, I'm still at Verbund in Dongen. Um, as I showed, they have a big yeah, showroom of goalie gear, but what they also have, they of course, they sell goalie stuff. Um, not just a little bit, because I'm now in the back. Um, here they have. Some some helmets, some helmets. They have some arm guards there. More cages for helmets, gloves, um, more cages for helmets. What are these? Over pants. Um, some laggards in the back. And then you think, okay, those are already a couple of laggards. Then I'll show you this part. A lot of plastic bags. And then you think, <laughs> a lot of plastic bags. Now every bag is a set of laggards. Every color combination, every size you can think of, they have it over here in stock. Pretty awesome, huh? Some more laggards. And of course, a lot of kickers. Not just a couple, I think these are 10 pairs of just blue large kickers. <laughs> you have them in red, orange. And this is the only place in the world, the only store in the world that only sells goalie gear. Nothing else, just goalie gear. And it is big. It's just this whole building. Uh, maybe people in Holland, they know it's Verbund, uh, but I think when you're from another part in the world, um, this is pretty crazy. Uh, if you want a shark uh, deflector to train, they have it. Or do you want 10 maybe? <laughs> they have some rebound boxes, just a couple, and gloves. You want a glove? Green with red, pink and blue, pink and orange, 
Blue and orange. Black and yellow. Everything you can think of, they have over here. So uh, if you need goalie gear uh, and you're in uh, Belgium, Netherlands, go to Verbind. Best place there is. Do you want a helmet? Or do you want to have helmets for your entire team? <laughs> Okay, I hope you really like this video. If you've got any questions about uh, Verbund, about the new oboe kickers, um, or just a question for me, uh, doesn't matter, put them in the comments and uh, like the video, subscribe on YouTube, and I hope you enjoyed it. See you next time. Bye-bye.